Hey YouTubers, Glenda here. Hey, uh, I wanted to tell y'all about the new book that I just released. It's about healing, and it's about receiving healing from God, and it's called The Healing Companion, and it's available on my website, wingsofprophecy.com, and also on amazon.com. Now, as y'all know, I, st I suffered a hemorrhagic stroke in 2012. When I came home from the hospital, I honestly wondered if I would ever drive again, uh, if I would ever walk with a walker again, uh, if I would ever be able to smile on both sides of my face, you know, that sort of thing. I get tons of requests in the mail every day for people uh, asking me to pray for their healing. If you would like to say goodbye to sickness and disease forever, you can. That's the good thing. You can. If you believe in Jesus Christ, you have the right to be healed. Have you ever been sick or, or been in pain and just, you know, confessed that you were healed and read all the scriptures and confessed and confessed and believed and everything and then nothing happened? Well, that had happened to me repeatedly over and over and over. And I was like, what is the deal with this? Don't I just say that I'm healed and then I'm healed? I mean, God's word says that I'm healed, right? And I got so frustrated because I have a lot of faith in general and I didn't understand why I couldn't receive healing and why I couldn't get healed in I was so tired of being sick, and, and I, you know, I know that some people think that them being ill glorifies God. I disagree. There's nothing about sickness that could possibly be glorifying. You're laying in bed. You can't pay your bills. You can't go to work. You can't take care of your kids. You can't take care of your house. You can't take care of your family. How does that glorify God? That doesn't glorify God. He doesn't need our suffering to glorify Him because Jesus already suffered on the cross for all of us, okay? So, if your sickness is not to glorify Him, well, why is it there? You need to find out the answer to that question, don't you? If you would like to say goodbye to sickness and disease forever, get the Healing Companion. It's available in print and in Kindle. Um, and it's an easy read. It's 226 pages. And there's pictures in there, y'all. I actually put personal photographs in there, including photographs of me right after I had the stroke. Uh, as embarrassing as those are, because I used to have hip-length auburn hair, and when I woke up from the stroke, it was a giant mall, matted ball on the back of my head. looked like a big ball of matted dog hair. It's pretty gross. Uh, and I wore it that way for weeks, because I couldn't comb it out. So, um, God wants you to be well. He really, really wants His people to be well. And we live in the end of the end times. We need to be well, y'all. For what's coming, we need to be well. Okay, it's going to be real hard to fight the enemy and fight persecution and fight illness all at the same time. And if you're not suffering from sickness or disease, now is the time to learn about healing because it's easiest to get the understanding that you need when you're on the level of you're just having a headache or a cold or the flu or something like that. Don't wait until you have cancer or have a stroke like I did. God wants you to be well. Get the healing companion. It's $15.99 on Amazon.com. The Kindle is $8.99. Uh, I'll put a link under this video to my website, wingsofprophecy.com. And if you read it and you like it, please leave a review on Amazon. I would really, really appreciate that. That would mean a lot to me. And it would help your brothers and sisters in Christ know whether the book will help them. God bless you. Thanks for watching. I hope you have a great week.